What is up guys, it's your boy Craver and I'm here with the quick tutorial for you guys suggested by my good friend Tricky and um, hopefully you guys enjoyed last video, the um, roast myself challenge, it was very bad, I, I have to admit, I suck. But I'm here on a tutorial on how to make a thumbnail suggested by my friend Tricky and so you don't have to download anything, you could just go on pixlr.com slash editor and then you click open image from computer or yeah open image from computer and before you do this you want to download a DSR PNG so you want to download a, P a PNG of a DSR you want to download a Call of Duty map or it depends what thumbnail you're making CSGO uh, it could be a CSGO guy holding a knife PNG it just has to be anything that matches with their video so if it's Call of Duty you want to get a DSR PNG a map from Call of Duty and um and I think that's pretty much it. Oh, you also want like these you have to look up whatever color you want your outline to be. So if it's like orange, you're doing orange, you want to get an orange splatter. So see right here it says blue splat splatter. Let me drag these in here so this won't get messed up. CSGO. I think I'm right. So I'm going to make my uh, my thumbnail later because this is not the only video today. I'm going to make another video today, but you want to go to open image and then you want to go to downloads or wherever your pictures are that you took from the internet. And you want to take the map that you're doing. So I'm doing raid for you guys. I want to open it up. It's kind of small, so let's get a new one. Now let's get studio. Studio is much easier. It could be any of these. It just has to be big enough. Hopefully this one's big enough, I hope. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this one's big enough. So you want to go studio. Let me throw away the raid. Worst raid. The raid goes in trash. And I'm going to try to do this as fast as I can because I don't want this video to be very long. So, yeah. Okay. Open image from computer. Download studio open. Okay, so you open oh my whatever whatever just I'm gonna cut into I found like a good picture I could use so Okay so I have a map I'm using carrier today um where's carrier Oh here it is so open it up Alright that's perfect So now what you wanna do is you wanna take open image you want to take your DSR, open it up, and then you want to control A or command A. So you can select all and command C or control C. So you can copy it. Then you want to go back to this carry picture. I just press the tab. And then you want to control V. And then it pops up here. And you're like, oh my god, it's way too big. I want to resize it. So you go to edit, free transform, drag it to wherever you want it to be and shrink it up. I want it to be a little bit bigger. That's good. I think that's okay for today. And if you want to put like add a little glow, you want to click this thing right here and then you want to put outer glow. And since our theme is going to be blue, we're going to put it all the way blue. Okay. And if you want to make it glow more, just go back to outer glow, put up the hardness, and then put up the size. Like that. Now it's glowing. Okay, so now you want to add the text. To add the text, you want to go to flaming, flamingtext.com. Once you go to flamingtext.com, pick whatever font you want. Or you can use the fonts in online, um, in Pixlr, but the fonts are not that cool there. Alright, so I want to use this one. Crazy. Alright. 
So what you want to do before you like make the text, you want to go to background and make it transparent so you can actually put it on here. And if you guys want, you guys could change the color. Let's see what color. Okay, so I'm back and what I did is I put this to white or a little bit gray and then I put this to blue and then you go back to the text and you change it. So this is going to be one one v one face off see and then you press next you don't press by logo don't press by logo press download it downloads you could get out there now drag this to your downloads folder if it's not there already and then just open file file open image press the text and it's there so we're going to do the same thing we did with the DSR command A or control A control C or command C and control V or command V now you want to go to edit free transform one like get to where it has like that little rotating thing and then you want to rotate it So there, now you have your text, and all you want to add is the splatters. So let's go ahead and add splatters. Go to File, Open Image, pick the splatter you had, and now it's here. So Control A or Command A, Control C or Command C, and then Command C or Control C. Okay, so Edit, Free Transform, put it in the little corner, extend it. And then you want to dole this out. So I'll, I'll do that in a second. I'll dole this out. And then you want to keep on controlling C and Command C and edit free transform. And add him until you don't want any more. Alright, I'm going to add one more next to the gun. Now, what you want to do also, I forgot to do this earlier, so you want to go to background, so check all this out. If you want, you don't have to check all this out, but I think it will be better. And now you want to go to edit. No, you don't want to go to edit. Uh, my bad. You want to go to this thing right here that shows like a blue fading gradient tool. Press that. Press the gradient right here and pick this one. Since our theme is blue, we're putting blue right here. And we're going to move the black a little bit up and the blue all the way up and then the black down. So then you're done. Just go like this as much as you want, and then there, boom, you have it. Then look what happens when I add all this back. That's when it doles out and it looks more professional. But, anyways, I'm done with this video. 11 minutes and 16 seconds, that's actually pretty fast. But, anyways, if you guys want another tutorial or and something else that will help you guys or if you guys have any questions just comment down below thank you for watching like subscribe and peace out